hello everyone welcome back to the channel i hope you all are doing good today i'm going to make some aloko and fish as well and i'm going to show you all how i marinated my fish from scratch so yeah let's get started So let's start by marinating our fish. I'm using tilapia for this recipe. The fish is already cleaned. Make sure your fish is cleaned as well. Now I'm going to make my seasoning by mixing about two to three tablespoons of my green seasoning. Next, I will add the spices. I have black pepper, garlic powder, and some fish seasoning. You also have paprika, some red pepper flakes as well, some mustard, and some vegetable oil and make sure you add a great amount of mustard and vegetable oil I will adjust it later on mix it well until you obtain this beautiful looking nice mixture and then at this time we're going to start to season our fish don't forget to make some small incisions to it to make sure the seasoning rich inside the fish and of course we're gonna take our time to make sure this fish is well seasoned inside and out Once we're done marinating the fish, I'm going to cover this entirely and allow it to marinate. I did it overnight. As for the remaining of the marinade, I will add it later on to the fish. So for this recipe, I chose to grill my fish on charcoal grill because I wanted to do the poisson braise thing. And it kind of burned my fish a little bit because of the heat it was too much so keep in mind to reduce the charcoal a little bit you don't want your fish to burn if you know what i mean don't forget to add your marinade mixture on top of the fish as well grill both sides and that's it since i'm pairing the fish with the plantain i chose to do the fish first so in the meantime i'm going to keep it in a preheated oven to keep it warm I have these beautiful plantains here that I'm going to pair with my fish as I mentioned earlier. So fry them on medium high heat to high heat until golden brown. You can choose a salad as a side or even a chicken if you want to. They are great sides as well. All ingredients used are listed in the description box. Don't forget to check them out. Make sure you add them in batches if you have a large amount of plantain to fry. 
so yeah guys this is it for today's recipe quick and easy to make as you can see we have the aloko we have the fish on the side and some hot pepper sauce as well this hot pepper here was super super spicy y'all and tasty at the same time <laughs> if you enjoyed watching today's recipe please like subscribe if you haven't done so and turn the bell notification to be notified whenever a recipe is uploaded on my channel. Thank you so, so much for watching and I'll see y'all on my next one. Take care.